Alrighty, let's play this. There is no sound, which is a bummer because I watched so many with sound and this will benefit. <laughs> caca! <laughs> Not that it has to be a caca. And actually, let me bring up my face up here so that his name is down here. This I picked because it's awesome. And the reason, the other reason why I'm picking it is for two areas. And it's interestingly set up there. I know he wants to hit that tree, but it's a bummer because it starts to, I know it's towards the end. And I understand what's going on. I know I understand he throws. There are a couple of things. A, there's something off in the pivot where I feel like it's something off of here versus the center of mass there. There's something slightly strange as it goes down. But then it's kind of a bummer as it gets to really kind of mess up the silhouette a bit just for that for that moment. I don't know. Me personally, I would subjectively, of course, I would not have that tree impact and just go for a throw and then double down. I'm going to go after this guy and do something else with it. Um, that would be my, my thing here. And the other thing here is this just feels so slow and i'm not really seeing slow motion because i'm looking at thor and it's quite fast there and also the recovery i'm not seeing a specific moment where things are slow motion so i'm i'm not quite feeling this where it's already anticipating the hit and once you get there it's just so soft and it's hit and recovery i don't know i'm maybe i'm missing something but i still wanted to critique it and uh, put it out there. Maybe someone in a comment can let me know what, what they think about this. But I think this is, other than that, really, really cool. I would just really speed up that boom, that impact, and then come down, and the rest is super cool. Because I like the action of coming into this, oh, the whole staging, the look of it, the lighting, the rendering. I love that it grabs him for that. Dynamic camera work, has good weight into that throw. I like how the posing on him changes where he has a nice clean look into this. Maybe bringing that arm a bit higher so you have a cleaner look on what that silhouette is so it's not just kind of that stumpy thing. That's a bit better. But I like that that arm does go off kind of like a messier throw recovery in that moment. That's really cool. The only thing I would say watch out for the tracking on 2D effects as things are moving and this is kind of stuck in Sweetie space there. I almost wish it was almost a bit longer. We kind of need to extend that. I know that's the challenge, but seeing this not hitting the tree, right? And it would still be here, then going out for maybe one more hit. But it's mainly that. Mainly those those points here. You could argue maybe something in here that would maybe take this away. I don't know what that is. Is that from his hands? Probably in front of him. It gets a bit dark, but it would be kind of neat. Oh, after this to kind of see the face oh, it's like some strained face in the teeth I do like this pose though and then potentially because he does this right and he starts to grab it looks like he starts to grab that arm that's the other thing that potentially I will clean up here where we're getting into this and then what's going on we're not we don't see the face this is all a bit mushy in terms of silhouette and then is he grabbing the arm is he ripping something off I mean I'm seeing that's his wrist so that's his wrist here. So it's not really. So like all those are the, the things that I'm kind of thinking about when I see this. Like what is this move right here? Is this maybe it could be something where arms are here pushing the character away so that there's a distance, anticipation, hit. Or is it something where he wants to pull the character down? I don't know. Like there's something I think that could be cleaned up there just through that moment. I'm not quite sure what is going on through there. The, but the biggest thing to me is this. Just that. I don't know what I'm missing here, but it's it's almost surprising because the rest is so well done. It's so cool. I'm not sure why this is anticipating the hit and also so slow and soft. But the rest is super, super cool. Shabang! Again, you can be picky where potentially you would have a stronger... If, you know, if the character comes down or goes up here and down faster, it might even clear things where that arm might be in a backwards swing right so you land shaboom, because of that impact compression swing back on that arm meaning that this arm being back here will clear up all of this here for silhouette so that the character here thor could be lower long anticipation clean silhouette of that arm down here 
to then go up and then hit the guy. You know, to maybe make that moment maybe a bit sharper and more impactful. Because that is all cool. Boom! That has a really good good feel and hit. Love the spreading of the fingers. Clear there as well for the grab. This all reads. It's like this is all super cool. Like the little slight re-grab and change there. That's great. And if you may be being super picky. Not really though. Maybe I can bring my my camera down again. Down here covering the name. Sorry, where you might go a bit stronger with with the the back lead, right? Where it's stronger in this, where that arm gets to be almost extended as in holding this go back with the chest that extends that arm but you're leading with that chest and then you start pulling with the arm right so you're like this but imagine you're rotating this up and leaving this arm down so that you get not a full extension but a longer uh a longer version of that arm right and then you you bend that arm for a pull into the throw Again, super picky, super picky stuff, but I will leave it at that. It's an awesome shot, and that's it.